Welcome back, everybody. Well, it all started while working at a restaurant in college. He was selling wine by the glass just to make extra tips. Wow. Now he's a seasoned sommelier who even has his own wine shop in the West Loop. And Derek C. Westbrook is breaking barriers, too. I don't typically dress like what most people think of sommeliers. I don't talk like most sommeliers. And some people probably think I don't look like most sommeliers, but here I am. There's less than 250 master sommeliers in 100%, the country. Yeah. Only three African American. 100 percent Yeah. It's gotta feel good though to be able to kind of change that dynamic and let people see you and be an example. I'm the cool sommelier. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like and you also have created a wine and music series. Sample Samples is pairing wine with music. Wines have tones and textures to them just like music does. And the way I can teach you wine in a way that feels more comfortable is by talking to the guys in music. Not only do you have music, you have wine, but now you have a candle. So we dropped the candle that's based on uh, a red, rich, creamy red wine. So the notes that you're gonna smell are notes that you'll find in those wines. So we need some hands-on training yeah, here. This, You're is, gonna... this is very important right yes. now for the hands-on training. Right now, these are the things I'm in love with at this very moment. So the wine on your right is a Lambrusco. So Lambrusco is a sparkling red wine out of Italy. Um, has a little bit of sweetness, a little carbonation. Okay, cheers. Oh, I can taste that carbonation. Mm -hmm. I like that. And you drink this chilled. I wasn't drink it expecting chill. it yeah, to be cold. Exactly, yeah. So next is California Cabernet, um, particularly Wade Cellars, three by Wade. The cab is one of those kind of safety nets for people. So I want to show them a wine that, hey, it's okay to have that safety net, to have that go-to. It's a tough day at work, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> so now we're going to get a little geeky, okay? You okay. ready? So okay. this is a white wine, right? Yep. You got that part? Feel yeah. good about that? Yeah. Right. So you, you passed the first uh, okay, test, right? I got that. Also, I'm a sommelier. <laughs> there you go. But my number one rule with wine drinking is, is it yummy? Is it yummy? Is that a technical term? <laughs> it's my, yes, my technical term. All right. That one's good too. Mm -hmm. What society takes away from it is our identity. We come into this world and whatever our proclivities are, the way we look, the way we act, we get told, no, you have to fit into this box. So as a sommelier, I don't want to be a part of that. What I want to do is give that back to you. And as long as it's yummy, it's right. There you go. And that's the key, right? Do you know what every single wine tastes like in here? Yeah. So if I picked a random wine... What I'll do is I'll look this way. Yeah. You go pick something, and then I'll tell you about it as soon as it hits the table. Okay, I'm gonna pick one of my favorite kind of wine. Okay, if I can just taste it on the fly. Oh, so it has a little bit of funk. Juicy, red fruit. Oh, I think I know this one. <laughs> Pinot Noir? Yes. This is a uh, Rhinish Pinot Noir uh, out of Austria. Oh my God. It's like Joe, I, I can't say yes. the first name. Yeah, is it? Yeah. Boom, there we go. <laughs> Dude, that was, that's unbelievable. Hey, I told you, we taste everything that comes in. So yeah. Oh my God, I love Derek. Yeah, he, that guy should have his own TV show. And how about I had the choice of all of those wines and he nailed it. I asked him if he drinks wine every single day. He said, it's his job. Mm -hmm. yeah. He said almost every single day. Somebody's got to do it. Yep. And, and now it is our job to try this. And the candle, blacker the berry. Sweet of the juice, baby. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> Check out Derek C. Westbrook on his <laughs> website. You can order the candle and you can order wine. And check out his music series. You can learn more there, no, too. I want to check him out in person. I want us to go there. Hey, uh, uh, are you free later? Hey. <laughs> no. I got to go be basketball mom. Oh, oh all yeah. right. Well, Rich, are you free later? Yeah, we'll do it. You, know, you uh, guys aren't going without me. You're going to wait. We could do spill or sip instead of spend <laughs> or say. I, I love it. it. I give this a big sip. Okay. He needs. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.